long time today, recognizing that Richard does science well. <laughs> but I want to say for a minute that he does love and family even better. And Richard, you do. Over the years, we've had um, a tradition, a habit, habit of having coffee together in the morning. I never make it. It always shows up next to my bed. You are a very generous man. As a parenthetical statement, I never find the dishwasher full either. It's always empty. <laughs> You're a good man, Richard. Our habit is to have coffee in the morning and a glass of wine in the afternoon. During these times, I have learned so much about science. I've learned about plasma physics. <laughs> you can test me later, Dave. You know, you know, you will. Um, I've learned about the radiation belt. I've learned about the magnetic strap. I've learned how to love Danny Summers, and that is not easy. <laughs> When Richard says Danny's in town, I go, oh, okay, okay, so is he eating fish now, or nothing, or what is he, right, darling? And Richard said, no, he's only eating harp seals this week. Love you, darling, you deserve it. Uh, back to you, Richard. Um, I've learned so much about science from you, and probably many of the people in the room are like this because you're breakthrough thinkers. It's very common for Richard to wake up in the night and I'm somehow understanding that he's awake and I'll say, why are you awake? And it's because he's had a thought about something. He's had a thought about something that he's thinking about, a problem that is only partially solved or hasn't been solved yet. And he cannot sleep because that's what he cares about. And I've really enjoyed learning about science through a person who is passionate about science. But, as I started, Richard also is a very loving person. He is a lifelong learner and he has learned about me. And I think that's what marriage and love is about. Richard is a patient person. He's a good listener. And he's taken the time to understand over the years what I need. So even though it's all about science and his career is very important, I've learned to be a parent and I've learned how to communicate and we've helped one another. I just want to say, I value you as a lifelong learner. I value what you've taught me. And I appreciate that you've learned from my family and from me. So thank you. We're going to have a lot of fun in retirement. <laughs>